Riley told me it was MJ. Mears told him to do Who it. Who got set up then? I will not end up with you the way you are now. I don't want you to choose the wrong contractor. Like, do you trust me or not, dude? We're doing the baby transfer on Friday. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> 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 What happened to Goldessa? I'm oh, already tired. We got this. I think we're supposed to breathe from our noses or some shit. I don't know if I can do this anymore. My tits hurt. We're going to pace ourselves for Gigi. You want to wait for them here? Do this sure. together? Yeah. Do you smell body odor? <laughs> Terrible. <Dirt. laughs> 100% they quit. We're going to cheat. This is, they have to come back this way. So we're going to stand right here. I think we should just yeah, let's, let's go. Let's yeah, go. yeah. We're last place now. It's all good. We'll catch. So we'll splash some water on our faces or something, maybe. I mean, in life, you got to find secrets and ways to kind of get to your destination sooner. I think I got the huffing down like that. <sighs> yeah. Oh, yeah, you've been, you killed it. You're going to get first place in this. And so in this situation, Vanessa and I... I just inhaled a fly. We have a plan. I'm tired already. Already? I like... know. Even my doctor said you need to start some light cardio, Vanessa. For what? My Which doctor. doctor? Just, no, just a general. Oh, okay. like, it's just it's like you need to just start, because I'm, I'm in a healthy, really healthy place in my life right now. I'm really ready to have a baby, and so I started the process of IVF. I decided I need to keep this a little bit of a secret for now, and I'll decide when to tell everyone else later. Who wears white to a park? Um, Vanessa. Rich people. Ooh. So do you think you'll come? Yeah. Is Destiny invited? So that's a great question. I, I think I should talk to her beforehand, because otherwise I'm not going to want her there. Yeah. From the beginning, Ali's been telling me it was the three of them, MJ, Destiny, and Ali. I don't really know who's telling the truth. I just don't believe any of them. I went and met with Destiny and this Ali guy. First thing he says to me is, your husband sexually harassed me for three years. Me being sexually harassed. He's done it to other people too, OK? I lost my mind. In that moment, I realized he talked to someone. Ali told me it was MJ. He FaceTimed me. You don't understand when I was telling MJ about like the pictures and stuff. And she's like, oh my god, that's borderline sexual harassment. And I'm like, what? It doesn't feel good. No, I'm, I'm sorry, babe. I'm so sorry. It doesn't feel good. Can I sit on your lap? Yeah. She's still working for me throughout all of this time. She's so supportive and loving. And it's like, how do you let go of that when you've never had that before? It's like very stressful for me. Everything that's in momentum has to be put on pause. Well, no, we can't put things on pause. So you have to manage it. Don't give me the attitude, Erica. <laughs> Erica has accepted a job running talent for a major shoe brand in Barcelona. From a selfish perspective, this is terrible for me. It catapults me back into the minutia of these projects. And I'm like, I have to go to the gym. It's sushi time. Like, I can't be bothered with this kind of stuff. Like, we're not together and all of that, but like, it feels like you, like you're on your own now. I am on my own now, though. It's a weird dynamic that we have. It is, but I think at the same time, we should both be grateful that we can go through everything we went through and still have a strong, lucrative working relationship together. I just always assumed we would, like, get married and, like... I don't know why you would think we would get married. I can't imagine two people that love each other like this could, like, not end up together. I will not end up with you the way you are now. I know Erica doesn't want to have a relationship with me, but I'm not ready to, like, let her go. Sometimes I think that you're, like, the best relationship in my life, and I think I'm the worst relationship in your life. I definitely think I can do better than you. To the rescue! <laughs> Art! Look, look, the tow truck guy just came. Look. Wait. 
Yeah, look at the car. Okay, they're gonna drop off the car to you. <laughs> ah! Are you okay? Oh my god! It's pregnant! Oh my god, it's pregnant! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I've never dealt with this kind of shit. What the f you do with the possum? Oh my god. Push, Bubba! Push! <laughs> Oh my god. I feel this possum. Hello, damsel in distress. That's why I needed to make sure that this possum is okay. Listen, you got this. You're a f***ing possum. You are strong. You are crazy. Hold on, you guys. The possum's having a baby. Where did he come from? I have no clue. All of a sudden, she was just chilling with me, literally kicking it. Oh, you're so sweet. Yeah, save the day. Don't be scared. Yes, yes. The guy who came to the possum's rescue for sure is like some sort of Prince Charming. Yes, you save the day. But the reality is, is I'm not into princes. But I do want to believe that there's like a Viking warrior out there for me. I mean, a possum found Prince Charming. Have some babies. I got hope. <laughs>